and welcome to my channel. It's Rebecca, also known as a Four Kids at 147. And I finished my London sort of pop art diamond painting. Um, so this one was really, really fun to do. Um, I, li I quite like confetti, but I also don't mind blocks of colour. So it was quite nice in this one that every now and then I'd have a block of colour. Um, so I could just you know do some but then there was some confetti so it sort of mixed it up a little bit for me and kept it interesting which was nice um charting and symbols were really clear um diamonds wise that there are loads left i mean the i kitted up two at once so this is the diamonds left over um from this painting plus these two little pots here um this one's still pretty full I'm trying to think what else was a main colour. Oh, there we go, 606. I mean, that's a bigger pot and that's still pretty much full. So plenty of diamonds left over, um, which is good. However, some of the diamonds were not what I'd call wow quality. There is, um, especially near these browns and blacks, the, one of the browns was the worst for it. Um, I mean, there was one that had sort of a coating on it, a bit like talc. Um, so that made it a pain to place. I could have washed them, but I was being a bit lazy. Um, but the fitting quality of the dark colours could actually mean that I have the odd little bit of popping drills over this side. Not a huge amount, not enough you know, that it would stop me working on the painting or would be seriously infuriating. Um, but there is a couple of drills that just don't seem to want to stay put. Um, and it wasn't like it had a little, a little nub on the edge of the drill. It was as though it had, you know, a bit of, a bit of the plastic flat underneath. Um, so I have got a roller uh, which I have given it a little go over and when it was all black or these colours some of these colours were really nice to work with um, it's fine and you know it's just the usual moving about of the diamond painting but there's a lot more clicking I'm not sure if you can hear that and it's nothing underneath um, it's definitely flat but there is a couple of sections where you seem to constantly be clicking them in and then they pop back up. So, you know, when they're popping back up, it's because they're definitely not fitting. Um, so there is a little bit of disappointment with that, but I think the chirpy image sort of makes up for it. <laughs> um, it's not the worst company I've ever used. Um, it's from AliExpress and I will pop a link down below um, for it. I say I keep running my hand over in it and every now and then, it's, see it's up here, it's sort of the greys and the browns and stuff were a little bit off. Um, but they're not falling out, there's just to say, there's just about three diamonds on the painting that I could probably go through and exchange them um, and they may sit a bit better. But it did just get a little bit annoying when you're doing a load of confetti and they just don't want to sit right. I mean, this one here is driving me up the wall. So I'm trying to find my pair of tweezers in here. So this one is popping up like nobody's business. And I think it's because the one next to it. See, look, there's actually like a little row. It's as though they all need nudging up. So there's something in there somewhere that's stopping them from doing it. And I'm not sure where it is. So I've just taken those two diamonds out. So I'm gonna see if I can get them to go back in, get myself some fresh ones and see if I can get ones that haven't got anything on them. That one looks okay and try and place them back in. And actually, this is the one that had a coating. It's like, it's as though it's covered in talc. 
see if I can get that one to fit in or if it's actually something further up. Okay, that seems to be fitting a bit better because it's not popped back up again yet. So maybe just taking out those two diamonds and popping new ones back in has helped. But that was the most annoying spot on it. Um, apart from that, they do seem to sort of, if they have popped up, they seem to go down and stay down. I'm trying to work out if that was another one. It's all around these sort of browns and greys that it's doing it, not so much around the rest. So, yeah, a little, little bit disappointing that that happened, but it's such a funky image, isn't it? I really do think that's pretty cool. Um, but anyway, it's done. I like it. Um, I'll pop a link to it down below. Say sometimes you, you find drill quality, especially when it's only slightly you may find that you order the same painting and have no problems whatsoever um, because the sellers by then moved on to a different batch of drills um, but there's a few different cities that they do and I may or may not order another maybe in a smaller size because I know it's one I'm not going to frame um, maybe that'll look good but I say I'll see um, I'm not against using the seller again uh, just a little bit disappointing um, especially because the two I worked on, um, I had issues with both of them, but I was more annoyed with the other company than I was with this one. But anyway, thank you so much for watching and for listening, um, and I'll speak to you all again soon.